Yo, what is up guys, and we are back, finally, t I know I haven't uploaded in a while some all-stars, but we are finally, I finally uploaded some more Pokemon Blaze Black 2 all-stars, and as you can see, I changed Mandigara's name to, um, Ken, because, like I told, like I said in a previous episode, Mandigar did delete his channel and he was pretty much missing from Skype and stuff showdown for a few months but now he's finally back and I've talked to him a, f a little not not that much because it's only been a few weeks since I actually found out he returned but yeah basically he started up his new channel that will be linked in well not linked hello it, w it will be his channel link basically will be in the description down below like all the other all-stars his new channel so make sure to go check him out subscribe makes really good stuff and yeah m make sure to help him out he just started fresh again really good friend and yeah so now that that's been said I did just go to the Pokemon Center, get, got some repels because we are gonna take on the Charge Stone Cave, and that is gonna need a butt fuck of um, repels. And I did heal all the my niggas, so let's just tackle this. Sh sh okay, now that that's all said and done, let's go in. I have already put on a repel, and Bianca is gonna talk to us. Did you know this, that if you push the floating stones, they move? Yes, we all know this because we are in Gen 6. This game has been out for what, um, three years now? Two years? Something like that. I'm not, yeah, I think it came out. I'm not quite sure when Black 2 came out. This is a hack, so what am I even saying? So yes, I want to use another repel. And let's collect this item. We did find a full heal, not even bad. And I'm not gonna bother with that because probably just a Pokemon or some bullshit flying gem or actually fly flying gem would be decent, but no, it's probably some other gem that I couldn't care less about. So now let's battle some trainers, which which is basically what we're gonna do in this cave. First up is a coughing and Pretty high leveled, but what's a coughing to a Blaziken? Nothing. That's what. I'm gonna hit him up with a Blaze Kick, and coughing is rather bulky, so I wouldn't be surprised if it lived. But no, we did get a crit, which is very nice. Nice speed boost, even though we pretty much outspeed the. Yeah, once one speed boost, we pretty much outspeed everything. And why did I stay in? Oh, well, let's see the raw power of Blaziken. High jump kick to the face. Nice, nice clean 70%. Luckily, we didn't get poisoned because, of course, with my luck, we would get poisoned. I'm not trying to miss, so I'm going to go for a blaze kick. And look, we missed. We're going for the most accurate move. Luckily, we still don't get the poison hack, so I'm going to go for another blaze kick. And luckily, we don't miss this time. Because, of course, I decide not to be risky. Go for the blaze kick because I don't want to miss a high jump kick and I missed the blaze kick. So some more bullshit, of course. Um, Electrode, you can go fuck yourself. High jump kick to the face. And that aftermath doesn't... Lauren doesn't even give a fuck. Level 43. Pretty much all our Pokemon are pretty much really high leveled, which is rather good because it, this is on challenge mode, so... It's never a bad thing, especially Garchomp, my lord, he's level 48. Obviously the leader of this whole thing. And let's go, and I think I just, oh well, I'm gonna fight him anyways. Fight, fight the scientist, let's see what he's got. Um, of course he has some garbage, complete garbage, come on bro. Nice shiny only if we could mega evolve but you know what a shadow ball will be enough and x attack of course because scientists love to do that bullshit oh my god what the fuck is this i don't need no help um nice shadow ball 
No Stantler. Um, I believe this is just a normal type. But let's go. And of course we miss. And combine, which is getting very dangerous. I'm please oh my god. I'm wearing wide lens. What is going on? Mandigar or Ken, which is now your YouTube name, simply Ken. Like I said, go check him out. Um, of course you would be hitting yourself. Where's your glasses, bro? God damn it. Don't hit yourself. And of course, do the opposite. Why not? I'm not even fighting a why not. I'm just gonna, like, hit myself. Yes, I told you. I called it. I'm, I'm... Triple hello. I I'm not gonna stop until I hit a fucking hypnosis. Finally. I'm gonna get some health back. I'm calling it. I'm gonna break out of the confusion. Confusion. Yep. Told you. And. Yeah, that did nothing. And before this thing wakes up and wrecks my soul with like psychic or some bullshit like that. I'm gonna go into um, Lauren and hopefully it doesn't wake up hits me with a psychic or some other shit like that I'm gonna go for a high jump kick obviously gonna outspeed I don't miss super effective and it's a dead it's gone complete destruction yeah of course I would miss so many hypnosis and hit myself like 50 times but oh well we all we already know my luck I'm not I'm I'm not even gonna complain because on showdown I'm fucking hacks everyone I battle so yeah I'm not gonna lie it feels good to record some more all stars it's been a while and by a while I mean like at least a month and let's move this rock oh no we cannot move it fuck you too fucking yeah let me go and oh nice ghost gem we could replace that in the future f for Ken so he can hit the nice and strong um, shadow ball but let's see who the fuck is talking to us hello we didn't even see him okay now let's see nice pushing rocks let's first yes I want another repel and let's go East trainer I'll fuck your shit up you want to tussle my um yes little side joke um we are the tussle god so oh my god and this is a triple battle so did we, we, we did get challenged to a tussle but no worries we have um what can I do I've basically I have Shadow Ball for the Vaporeon I have Blaze no let's hit him with a I have High Jump Kick for the Sawsbuck and I have Ember still for the Galvantula nice Shadow Ball destroying Vaporeon of course not fucking bulky ass monster nice crit definitely didn't matter because that's a motherfucking Blaziken and ember probably not gonna kill because it's an ember gastro acid oh no and yes I, I don't know who avoided the oh yeah of course and Lauren taking the hits doesn't even give a fuck um shadow ball should do the trick and I'm just gonna finish the Vaporeon off with a thunder punch and Ember to the Galvantula, destroying it once and for all. Nice Ice Punch straight in the face, breaking the Vaporeon's jaws, cracking its neck, and now it's fainted. And that was violent as fuck. What the fuck is wrong with me? Nice powerful Shadow Ball failed, of course. And the Ember burns the Galvantula alive, and it dies. Now, let's see. Did we, oh, oh well. Um, I don't even. Actually, that that might be a good item. I don't care. Okay, so it's this one. Then go, then go. 
And now we got a magnet. Of course. I thought it was something decent. Um, let's just block it so no one gets there. No one is able to pass. Because that's my territory. And I believe these guys give you nuggets. Yes, Nugget Man and Nugget Boy. Or whatever the other guy's name was. Yeah, big nugget and a small nugget. That's a nugget. Yes, I know. So yeah, kids. Um, Nintendo's basically telling you to go explore magnetic, magnetically, um, active caves and mines, and you'll find a guy and another guy that will just give you big gold nuggets for no reason. Sadly, this is Gen 5, and Gen 5 steel did not get nerfed, and it does not, um, basically, what am, basically, ghost and dark are resisted by steel. So, of course, this feral thorn is gonna eat up the shadow ball, obviously, in Gen, Gen 6, that's why Gengar is pretty much banned, because, um, steel, it doesn't give a fuck about steel types. Nice burn, power whip miss, so lols. Um, well, I mean, steel did get a, a a better use because of it's still a really good defensive typing, but it it's also a pretty good offensive typing now because um, it's pretty much one of the only two. Yeah, so only other move other than poison to deal with fairies and what that's why iron head is our iron tail is good on guard chump this well yeah the gen we're experiencing right now which is gen 6 not gen 5 that i'm playing at the moment but still this rom is this rom hack is amazing so let's keep on playing it and i don't have a capture card so basically i can't even if i wanted to which i actually do um, I can't do a X and Y let's play yet, but maybe in the future. And here comes the special, the special tank, Blissey and my lord. It doesn't even have to be EV trained to be a a tank. So let's go into the nice and powerful, nice and powerful. Um, Lily because pretty behind the only member of the all source that hasn't evolved yet. Oh, nice full heal. Of course, we are fighting a doctor, so. But we do have flame charge, so. That does a fuck ton of damage. And I did not read. I did not pay attention to what Blissey used, but it missed. So, rolls. And nice two hit KO. And look at the experience gain. God damn. I don't know. Lily, you're already fired up and everything, literally. So, I'll just end this experience boat's life. Oh my god. And it passed on its ability. Now we have. Oh, regenerated. Not even bad. Hit him up with a flame charge. Nice stab. And that's not doing a lot. Does this doesn't have thick fat why is this like not doing anything god damn it well stupid i don't know oh my fucking god fuck you too i want this experience all to all for lily it's just all for her and i just realized flame charge is doing way more damage um no do not switch out nice flame charge nice flame charge does a solid what like four hit four hit ko and obviously outspeeding because I'm like at plus something already. And finally, nice experience. Didn't even level up. A little bit disappointing to be honest. Um, leave any. Nice more experience for us. Four times the fact that this thing is definitely going to die. I don't care if it's a special or physical move. This thing is going to die to a fire type. And finally, we do level up. It's still not enough. I think it's 59. Oh. Oh, hello. Okay. 
I was like, I think it's 59 until he evolves. But no, apparently we are finally evolving. The last member of our All-Stars, Lily, is finally evolving. Because I guess in this ROM hack, um, what's it called? Um, goddamn, Larvesta evolves into Volcarona at level 44. And holy shit, we are learning Quiver Dance. Fuck yes. Um, actually, out, off screen, I might go to the hard scale person, see if we can get fiery, di fiery dance and um, bug buzz or something. Nice bug stab and a more powerful um, bug type special move we can use. Hey, fight me, bitch. And yes, we are. Actually, we are almost done with this cave. Not even bad. Making good time. Pineco, you're gonna die. Hit him up with a shadow ball. That should do a go. Oh my god. X the special defense. Fuck you. And he, it's that crit. Not even bad. Destroying things with crits. And Jinx, what, what's a Jinx to a fucking shiny, timid, Gengar, perfect IVs, because these are all obviously Poogie Gen. Fortress. Since Fortress is mainly defensive, I don't think he can take, I, he probably can take ones, even, probably because it's sturdy, well yeah. We got steel type. Oh well, it did not take it nicely at all. Automatize, and it's still not outspeeding because I'm a fucking Gengar. And that's a fucking fortress. And Smoochum, goddamn, this guy just has the whole fortress and Jinx evolution lines. And Shadow Ball is obviously just gonna wreck this Smoochum's life. It's gonna die just like its mother. And I believe. Obviously, oh nice dark pulse. We should forget. Um, let's just forget dream dream eater. I'll forget hypnosis better um later for a better move. And yeah, we need venom shock for now because nice powerful stab. And yes, we want another repel. And Bianca, we meet again. The fuck do you want, you bitch ass nigga? Um, of course, nothing important to say. And, oh, person, battle me now. Watch this be like a rotation battle or some bullshit like that. Um, nope. Ooh, the jump, the jump off, off. The tussle, tussle. Tussle off. Oh, I should have went for a Venom Shunk. Super effective damage. But oh well, this is a Stab Shadow Ball. Oh, nice acrobatics. Not even Flying Gem, though. I'm gonna go use Venom Shunk. Because I believe I haven't used it too much. So, yeah. Nice Venom Shunk. Destroying lives. Gengar is pretty good at tussling, I am on. TBHJS. Um, nice shadow ball to the face, and Flaren is actually pretty specially defensive, and goddamn, you would use some bullshit ass scary face shenanigans, oh my god, and it gets blaze kick in this hack, but I'm tanking that hit, fuck what you heard, shadow ball to the face, nice two hit KO, Yan Mega, I'm kind of scared of this thing, I'm, let's go see our brand new, Nice and powerful Volcarona that still has Ember, but it doesn't even matter because Lily's a fucking monster. Oh, nice. Hit him up with an Ember. And that one hit KO. The power, the sheer power. And we don't have a bugs, Bug Stab. Goddamn. And Tree Star Flame Body, no. And god damn it, we are not gonna get anywhere anytime soon. I mean, we do have flame charge. Nice, powerful stab physical move coming through. And it's 
Oh, fuck you with your confused race shenanigans. I'm um, breaking out. Yes. Very, very nice. And magical leaf. Hello. That's four times resistant, you fucking dumbass. That crit did nothing. Nice snapping out. Lily is just going clutch everywhere. Like always. Fucking monster. Destroying Gardevoir for days. And not even using a stab on um, bug move. And this bitch just can't even face the fact that I completely wrecked. And now let's. I think this is the last trainer in the cave because this is Blaze Black 2. We don't fight N at the end of the cave like um the original version or not the original virgin version, but uh, you know what I mean, black. And I'm gonna get out of here bef because steel, you know, like. Let's go into Lauren and I. Yeah. Nice full HP. Spark. Why would you go for Spark? Hit him up with a high jump kick. Never missing the high jump kicks. Watch me miss the next one just because I said that. Um. Speed boost. Hariyama. You know what? Just to prove how much hacks I get, I'm gonna go for a high jump kick. Watch me miss it. Nope, I actually hit it. And nice, another crit. God damn, Lauren, you are just fucking everything up. Like, damn, nigga. And let's get him up with a oh, light bulb. We don't have a Pikachu, and we're not catching a Pikachu and training it, so fuck that. Um, and we are finally out of this fucking cave. Okay, now let's go in. Let's heal up our shit. And this is good. Very good. We are at a very good position right now. Um, let's move our pokes a little. Um, I'm actually gonna put Dream in front because... Everyone's level 44, except Dream, which is 43, which isn't that bad. And then Kieran's 46, and Garchomp is just fucking 48. Like a fucking boss. And I believe you can get something here. I don't really remember. It's been a fuck ton since I... Um... Yeah, they give us an HP up. A nice HP up. Um, which doesn't even matter. And okay. Apparently didn't give us anything useful. And they're gonna talk. Yeah, this part is annoying. They're just gonna ramble on about some other bullshit about the Pokédex. Give us a Master Ball, which is not even bad. Just in case we catch that nice shiny. Does actually... I believe there's a way to transfer your like emulator Pokemon to an actual cartridge so I don't even know but I believe so so maybe if I if I don't forget mainly or like I realize it's not possible I could transfer over to Pokemon after I'm done with the let's play and do some nice Wi-Fi battles with them, which is, I mean, I'm pretty, well, Gengar is banned. We have two Ubers Pokemon in this fucking, we have two Ubers Pokemon in this game, like goddamn. And Shear Force isn't released on for Alligator, so it's kind of illegal right now. But I don't care. Um, yes, I want to use another repel just in case. Let's battle some more people. Of course, you're not battling us. But I mean, Gengar isn't banned. It's just um, Gengarite, which is Mega Gengar. So, I mean, we could work around it. And yes, Speed Boost Blaziken is banned, which clearly... Well, I understand why they would ban it. 
but I wouldn't ban it myself because um, first of all I never had a problem and second damn that not that nice Oko, that nice Oko, not bad dream, destroying lives. Nice Kangaskhan too. But we have Aura Sphere for that. I'm really liking um Um Dream's Moon Pool at the moment. I might just switch Metronome in the future for Tri Attack because Serene Grace and whatnot. But other than that, it's Moon Pool is really good. Air slash um side shock aura sphere. And yeah, so as I was saying, I don't know, I'm, I'm pretty sure they wouldn't mind as long as it's not a Mega Blaziken, because, I mean, Mega Blaziken should have been banned, and with all these threats running around, normal Blaziken with speed boost should have just been like OU, like top, top list OU. But, um, it's not my decision. I don't decide this shit. I just play the tier. And, yes. Let's try not to fall off and, like, bust our ass and shit. Let's battle these last few trainers. And then I might end off the episode. Nice triple battle. Bird mono. Fuck you. Because I have two things weak to. But you know what? I'm gonna be real. I'm just gonna air slash the unpheasant. I'm gonna thunder punch the ruffle it, and I'm gonna quiver dance. Cause I'm real. My realness is too good for you. Let's see how much a thunder punch does. Ruffle it is not bulky. Not it's not like Mandy Buzz. Nice Oko. And let's see how much an air slash does. Wait, what? Oh, I was about to say that I air slashed my own Pokemon. I was like, how stupid am I? Nice, again, another fucking Oko. Goddamn, Dream, you fucking monster. And punishment, goddammit. Bundle hole. Oh, holy shit. But we did get the nice burn, so it was a nice cause. And shit. Good job, Lily. Good job. Haxing your opponents. Now we can finish off an Air Slash, Thunder Punch, and Ember Combo, which is pretty much overkill. I don't care how bulky this thing is. Ember. Ember did a shit ton. And Thunder Punch is obviously gonna kill it. I mean, if it was Eevee Light, it might have lived to get hit by an Air Slash. But, I mean, nope. It just died. Bundle, but you were supposed to be bulkier. You're disappointing me. And now let's battle this last person with a Raichu. And Dream doesn't even give a fuck. Because Raichu's all... Frail ass nigga, I'm hit him up with a side shock. Holy fuck, he is fast. But we're tanking that hit, but of course we get the Parahax like some bullshit. And I'm gonna be real. And of course, Tail Whip. I went for the Metronome because I'm real. And of course we get some bullshit move. I'm gonna go for the Metronome again, I'm real. I don't care. It's not about winning, it's about making the realest plays. Nice side strike, see what I mean? The real plays coming through. Nice Oko with the side strike. And Dream is now level 45. And a Togekiss. Time for Kirin slash Casing. Oh, I almost forgot. Goddamn, see? I forget everything. Basically, um, how um, Kirin, um, also known as Casing, or his new channel. The shiny sea king went back to his old channel, <laughs> K-Snake. Pretty much, I don't know what's wrong with K-Snake. He just can't make up his mind and shit. So, basically, yeah. Um, he is now K-Snake 789 once again. Um, so, yeah, his previous channel 
will be in the description so yeah make sure to check him out he is back to his old channel which is always good because i i told him not to move he moved and now he's back so see listen to me guys that's something you need to know now and fuck you fungus fuck you watch me not be able to run away just because of fucking paralysis nope got away um, I'm just gonna battle this last person and end it off um, in front of the Celestial Tower. And fuck, I forgot to switch out. So Centred is gonna be able to wreck my life. Hmm, should I be real? Should I risk? Should I risk it? Yes, I sh see this is oh no wait amnesia raises special defense so it's gonna live this aura sphere fuck or not because dream is a fucking monster okoing everything I think yeah I think every single every single hit that dreams done in this episode has been an oko like goddamn you fucking monster now let's end it off end off this with the last um, few Pokemon getting destroyed by Garchomp and my god his shiny is oh my god it just looks the same and obviously since now we we know that Garchomp can fly we're gonna crash down on a fucking bird the irony there and completely crush its soul so guys thanks for watching I'm gonna end it off here hopefully um I don't forget and keep on doing episodes so it won't be another month until I do the last one and guys make sure to um check me out on Twitter I am really active there if you ever want to battle me on showdown and stuff I might just upload our battle if it's good um that will be in the description down below so yeah guys make sure to check me out on Twitter and also check out all the all stars their channels are also in the description don't forget that they are all awesome make sure to subscribe and I'll see you guys next time bye